You're looking at Common Core and uh, offering a path forward. Why? Well, uh, so far, the Common Core opponents uh, have not presented any Plan Bs, and I thought it was important that we have a guide in order to have uh, North Carolina go forward and not only examine the standards that we have now, but improve upon them. Some people have said these Common Core standards, they just need to go. You actually recommend that the process involve a lot of study and some new groups. Yeah, we should have two commissions, uh, one for English language arts and one for math, looking at the standards and evaluating whether they can be modified to improve them or whether we should just scrap them. Uh, these two groups will be made up of teachers, uh, parents, uh, professionals, and college professors, and they would have a very serious look at the studies, uh, to de at the standards, to determine whether uh, these are the standards that we need for North Carolina going forward. Forward. Why take this route rather than just say Common Core, let's scrap it? Well, we need standards. Uh, I think it would be a real mistake to just scrap the Common Core and to go without standards. So my plan is to simply keep Common Core in place temporarily until the studies are completed and we determine what to do about the current standards and then we can move forward. Your report mentions beyond the idea of standards, the importance of having new standards and a new curriculum. Why? Well, standards only get you so far. And I think it's important to have content that goes with these standards to ensure all North Carolina students are receiving a baseline level of knowledge uh, in math and English language arts. So not only will they receive the same content in my plan, uh, but they would all be tested on that content. And I think it just create a much more equitable system than we have right now. 